Hello friends, you are watching Arudire Plus, the professional CAD CAM solution provider. This channel provides basics of finite element analysis and computer-aided mechanical engineering design and analysis using CAD-related software. Let's get started. Hello friends, today I'll show structural analysis of a mechanical vice using ANSYS mechanical epidural. In this case, uh, directly we will apply load at the end of this vice. Uh, actually, we are not considering both the parts of a vice. A single part we are considering, right? So the model is already uh, drawn using PTC Crew and saved in IGS format that to be imported in ANSYS mechanical epidural, right? So starting from file, we have to import that one. Import IGS. By browsing, you can select that file. It is there in the desktop, so we can drag it from the desktop. It is saved by the name of part one IGS open it okay the part has come already now we have to provide this material properties and elemental properties also that will be coming from preferences as it is a static structural analysis so structure will be clicked okay then elemental property to be uh, provided it is coming from preprocessor element type add edit delete adding the element so in this case we have to select solid and 187 10 node 187 should be selected okay close it then material properties should be selected material properties material models structural linear elastic isotropic we are considering still of poisons ratio 0.3 and mo modulus of elasticity 2e5 right so modulus of elasticity 2e5 and Poisson ratio 0.3 okay material port is provided next one you have to go for meshing for meshing different options are available I will we'll select the easiest one by mesh tool we are considering smart size when to take more of fine and less of coarse meshes right this white mesh pick all meshing is done but it appears meshing is not perfect we want to have better meshing so we can go for refining meshes the so modify mesh refine at all this mesh is little bit better one you can go for further modification let's see again modify at all okay machine is done it's perfectly it appears perfect machine so next to that we have to apply boundary conditions so loads analysis type new analysis is a static structural analysis next one you have to apply load define load apply structural displacement on areas you have to fix the bottom part so for fixing we can do one thing we can change the orientation of this model you can see the bottom part okay, let's select that part done select it okay and all degrees of freedom should be fixed that is we are providing zero displacement at the bottom of surfaces so by default it will take zero value we are not providing all degrees of freedom that is with respect to x y z all direction the displacement of base part is zero that means it is fixed all it will not move at all okay now, now let's move on to move to the asymmetry view again next one you have to apply load or pressure right so it will be coming from pressure on areas this part you have to apply pressure is not selected properly so we can see the different parts like different orientation you can do it
this is perfect so we have to apply load we are applying load of pressure of 1000 megapascal okay pressure is done now we have to run this solution solve current ls if everything is perfect it will show solution is done this solving the solution is done so we got the results now we can see the results first of all we will see uh, form deform shape from general post processing we see the results first we will see uh, plot results deform shape deform plus arm deform it will show the original drawing plus a change drawing by the application of force or pressure the object will be deformed you can see by from the form view it will be better to understand like here in this case the white one is the original drawing and by the application of force or pressure the model has been deformed little bit the blue one is the deformed drawing right now we'll see displacement and stress also it will come from control port nodal solution first we'll see uh, df solution displacement vector sum this is showing maximum displacement equal to 7.3 millimeter and that is occurring at the red position that is top corner of this point maximum displacement this one okay and the blue part is having zero displacement again we we'll see the stress value now stress value one meter stress you can see here one meter stress equal to very high it is 67,855 megapascal. This is very high. That is, the object is failing. It is gone. Uh, actually, permanent deformation. Right? And the maximum stress is occurring at this point only. Okay? Because our load was also very high, we applied a load of uh, 1000 megapascal. So, by the application of force, it has gone permanent deformation. Right? Now, we will see all these values in the form of listing also. List results, nodal solution, DWF solution, displacement vector sum. We want to see displacement in the form of listing. It will provide thousands of results, and out of these results, we can see the maximum displacement also. And this is the average displacement sum. Average sum. You can see. The maximum displacement is equal to minus 7.116 millimeter and that is occurring at node number 36136 right now we'll see stress value nodal solution stress one is stress it will be in the listing format that is we want to see results in the form of numbers only right you can see here here the stress is maximum stress equal to Maximum average one meter stress equal to 54,225 and that is occurring at node number 35,681. This is the average one meter stress, maximum average one meter stress equal to 54,225. Right? And you can see here actually maximum displacement and stress occurs at this position only. Maximum stress is occurring at this point. Right? We can go for further refining mesh and you can check the we can see whether the object has undergone uh, convergence or not further machine can provide input results uh, so this is all about our finite elements static structural analysis of a vice right we have uh, actually we have done very simple analysis with a single part only we, it could be done using some other part also by the second part also okay if you like this video please subscribe and share and if you have any kind of doubts please write to me thank you so much for watching this video thank you again bye